So Minovision is a solution to take care of this condition called presbyopia. And presbyopia is the older eye, where you get to your mid-40s and you find you can't see up close anymore. So if you've got perfect vision, your distance is good, but you can't see up close. So Monovision is one of the solutions to address this. So with Monovision, you make one eye better for distance, one eye better for near. And the brain does the rest for you. The one eye is always in focus for distance, one eye is always in focus for near, and the brain moves between the, the two cameras that it needs. And it works for the majority of people, it works very well. So we get an idea of whether it's going to work for you directly at the outset. When you do the test, we'll do a test that shows you this is how perfect vision looks, this is how minor vision looks. And you can make that direct comparison and decide, yeah, that looks like it's doable or it's not. But to do it, to really try it, you do a contact lens trial. So multifocal lenses are lenses that each lens has the ability to give you focus for far and near at the same time. So you now have a multifocal lens in each eye, so each eye can see far, each eye can see near. So it sounds like the, the better solution, but it's also a compromise. So it's one that you've got to figure out and, and trial to see if it's a better solution than monovision. The contact lens trial you would do for anything from a couple of days to sometimes a couple of weeks and sometimes even longer. So the trial is meant to do quite a few things. It's meant to figure out which eye you prefer for distance, which eye you prefer for near, and then once you've established that, then you also do further trials to figure out what amount of near vision do you want. Because the stronger you make your near vision, the weaker you make that eye's distance vision. So the compromise gets bigger. So I guess one way of looking at the entire issue of trying to correct distance and near for someone who's 45 or older is you're looking at a range of compromises and figuring out which compromise works best for you. For most people, they find if it's worked in the trial, it's a whole lot better once you've had LASIK done or LASIK done but you want to make sure the person likes it in the trial before you do the procedure. We want to guide you through this process to make the best decision. And part of this is doing the contact lens trial. So the contact lens trial, based on your assessments within the clinic, will help us decide which solution is going to work best for you and which one's got the best chance of giving you the best result with the most longevity. And it will also help you make the decision in terms of the cost-benefit ratios and the risk-benefit ratios. But bottom line is we want to definitely work with you to, make, to get the best solution for you. I know for a fact that this is your first time or one of your first times of experiencing these solutions where we've done this a lot of times. We have 6,000 monovision patients, so besides all the other patients. So we've got a good idea of when it's going to work and when it's not going to work. But ultimately it's defined which solution of the variety we have is best going to suit you, your lifestyle, the way your brain's wired and your needs.